guys, welcome to Snowbreak Containment Zone, and I'm back. Hopefully for, you know, for more of a permanent basis, rather than missing for the past two months. So, um, just to clarify things up, I've been doing some projects on the side. Um, doing a couple, actually. Um, but I wanted to go back to this because I'm unloading a certain project uh, soon. That would give me more time for this, for more research, for more gaming, for more content, for more snow break, and for the other things that I have been playing. It doesn't mean that I haven't been, you know, uploading videos. I haven't, I haven't been playing. So I've, I've been playing snow break. I've been playing Aether Gazer surprisingly continuously, daily. So I'm actually just waiting for the next upcoming game that would be added to this channel. But for the meantime, guys, let us dive into this new trailer. Okay, this is, I think, the first time that we've had a lot going on in terms of banners, in terms of SSRs. So let's dive into the trailer, and I'll leave you my comments along the way and give you my thoughts on what has happened. <laughs> Mm. The devs are are actually uh, outdoing themselves. Uh, they outdid themselves this time. So two new, two new SSRs, guys, and two of the. You know the oldest, um, not the oldest, but the the first uh, characters that we have. We have Enya, we have Cherno, of course. So this is something that they return to, apart from giving us new characters. I think they gave us three new SSRs along the way before this one. So I'm kind of excited for this, especially for Cherno. I'm excited how they actually are. Improving her from the previous one. So hopefully she doesn't disappoint. Also for Enya. Um, I think we're going to get Enya for free. Uh, if you log in from May 2 to 30. So we'll be getting her for free. But for Cherno, you'll have to pull for her. Um, starting, I think, on the 18th. If I'm not mistaken. April 18th. So correct me if I'm wrong on that timetable. Yeah, May, April 18th to May 16th. So, this they're actually ramping up on what they're doing with, with Snow Break. And apart from, you know, apart from characters, the costumes have been, or the skins, have been on par. These two are actually... Are actually... Uh, what we need. We need these. <laughs> we badly need these. So, both designs are, you know, are, you know, on point. Although, oh, okay. Cherno's uh, skin, this one, the basic one, is actually on point. This is very unique. That is my comment. Unique in terms of the design. Similar probably to Kaguya's uh, Chinese New Year something something. But for Enya, uh, it, it's kind of a copy-paste of an old skin. But I really don't mind, you know, what is going on here. So, new weapons, of course. We have new outfits. As I mentioned, I'm actually sweating already. What I'm seeing. So, this one is, I think, one of the best that we've had. For those who are planning to get Tess, this is the this is way better than the previous outfit, I tell you. The secret date. And this one is one I think one of the outfits that we're all gonna get. It's too sheer for me. Can't concentrate. And this is a new, you know, new mode. So interactable scene combo gift pack. Oh my god. They are 
they are really going into the fan service for this one. Not bad. I think this is more detailed. We'll go more further. There are a lot of scenes here. So as you can see there. Uh, from what I know, you can only take off her shoe. Take off the shoe. I'm not sure what else can we take off. I'm not going to say anything. But... It's a lot of interaction, guys. And... Oh, my God. New Logistics Squad. So, um, they're doing without... They're, they're doing um, all-female. Um, all-female designs for the logistics. No longer males. And I think they're redoing the, the old ones. So, Asha is nice. Hopefully, in the future, we could get some of these logistics to be um, characters, playable characters in the future. Hopefully, hopefully. So, we have new gameplay as well. So, this is a fun capture gameplay. So, capture your enemies. This one is also new for Paradoxical Labyrinth. I'm not sure if the old one will disappear and it will be replaced by this one. Doesn't say. So, Clash of Honor update, fend off enemy waves, usual. We also have a new boss and the Dread together. We also have Endless Battle, which is the usual content that we have. So... Ooh. Okay, other new content in the game. So we do have a room for Nita, which uh, a lot have been asking. Hopefully she gets her 5 star soon. 5 star, not SSR. I'm sorry if I mentioned that earlier. So, <laughs> it's been a while since I recorded the video, guys. So, please bear with me. I am actually excited for this update. We're going to be covering skills next again. As soon as the skills are available, we're going to be covering it to see how they are going to be good. Um, well, Enya is going to be free. But for Cherno, if she is, you know, worth your pulls... New map here, Blessed Bazaar. We're gonna be going out of the the rocket base design. New maps, which is different. Nice. So that is it. So Gradient of Souls. It's happening on April 18th up to May 30th. What do I think? The devs are working hard on this, I tell you. Um, the skins are really, really on point. Even if you don't get the the additional skins with the skins that they have right now for the default ones, I don't blame you guys if you stick with them. Um, again, terrific designs. I hope that this takes Snowbrick somewhere you know going up i've seen that revenue has been up uh for snow break uh since katya and the other one the recent one uh, i forgot her name <laughs> uh white haired healer the five star one um but again I'll, I'll do some backtrack videos and feature um a tier list soon um, build guides that I haven't covered before the update drops on the 18th. So it's now on, we still have a, a week, I think, to go. We're on April 11th. So I still have a week to catch up on videos for you guys. And hopefully um, that makes up for the content that I missed in between after Katya. So again, I'm not away. I'm still here. I'm just unloading a lot of projects right now for me to go back to this. And, well, I'm really happy to be back. So, just want to go over the hump, give you guys more content. Hopefully, I could, you know, 
um, get the usual support from you guys. And for those who have been there with me from the start, thank you for sticking by me. I know life isn't easy. I still have to make a living for the family. Um, hopefully you could support me, guys. Um, subscribe, watch to the channel. Um, this really helps me a lot. And also, you know, for you know, for future content for the channel. So thank you very much, guys, for staying this far. Take care, stay safe. This is the warden. And I'm out of here. I already have long hair. <laughs>